So day to day I'm moving. I look horrible. I haven't gotten no sleep at all from packing. But I'm finna shower and then I'll get back to you guys. So I'm looking better now. But I had to get a COVID test for my school visit to be able to get ready. So I'll talk to you guys when I'm out. So I'm getting ready to leave. Um, my room is like. empty i guess but i think the saddest thing is not being able to bring my shoe so we getting ready to go on the drive get some gas and stuff like that um next time my report will probably be at the dorm because it's a lot to move i'm already sweating so i'll talk to you guys just finished getting everything like I wasn't able to record because it's just so much to do like I didn't think it would be this overwhelming but it is like I don't know it's just a lot to do I couldn't imagine what what would happen if somebody had to do this on their own like I just I just really can't but I'm going to continue talking when I have some better lighting and not in the car so it's not that many noises. So so I am back. I stopped recording my videos. Let me wipe this off because I want y'all to see clear. So I'm in my dorm. I got everything or my mom got everything set up. Um today just been really hectic like i'm so tired i'm running on hours of sleep um it's i'm not stressed out but it's it's a process like i don't i give props to anyone who has to do this alone because i would probably break down doing this like bringing clothes in bags in going to the store to get food snacks having to pick up heavy stuff refrigerators tvs like all that, that's that's a workout. And I appreciate my mom and my stepdad for helping me and all that. But um, probably between these days, I will give a tour of the place and stuff like that. I took a couple pictures and videos while we were on the way that I will add. And um, I'll just show y'all my room. So this is my roommate's bed she's not here um i just kind of got it set up 
so that I could see my TV and my game, my fan. But they got the air here on, and I'm already cold. Um, so I got my microwave, my refrigerator set over here, and then this is like a wardrobe closet. It's like super big, surprisingly. And like in here, once I put my clothes up, like it's all that space. And then it's my bed. It's like I don't know. It's like it looked like a boy room, but I got the chair. You got like a desk and a chair that you could pull out and stuff. But I got like my waters and snacks and stuff on the side, so you can't really see it. But it's I um like don't have a roommate for real. I do. Like we're cool, but. I'm alone, so it's a big room for one person, but with two, it depends on the setup and stuff like that. But I'm, I really thought that I would be scared to be alone and leaving and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm cool. Like, I just think if you're shy or like not really outgoing, you just gotta get out of your comfort zone. Some people you don't have to because they won't do it for you, but I really feel like you should and i feel like it's gonna be a good exper experience we just went to a meeting even though it's late eight to nine meeting we got water bottles we're gonna build a house tomorrow so we'll see how that go and yeah i'm tired um i just got a shower and get some food in my body and stuff like that so just hopefully things keep going well and i finally get some sleep but i wish i could have showed y'all more today i was really busy with everything getting everything i wish you could see the struggle of like constantly having to hold an elevator i don't got an id so i was calling my friend to let me even get in the building and stuff so it's just i'm i'm just happy i'm just settled and stuff and happy for the opportunity and to anybody who's watching, I'm happy that you support me or want to be a part of my life. So, yes, I am going to be going to sleep soon. So, thank you again. And I'm out.